y'all. <laughs> it's your girl, Misha Nae, back with another video. Y'all, so this is, as you gonna, as you, let me see. I really hope y'all can really see. And I'm gonna bring my food closer so you can see what it looks like. But I can't like, the setting might just be like this in this video, just cause how my camera is set up. Um, I need to work on bed, getting a better tripod to where when I'm eating, you like it's it's better for y'all to see. Anyway, this definitely a eat with me. <laughs> if you make those happy videos, eat with me. Anyway, yeah, I don't even know. I don't even know what to call this video. Uh, this is really like an announcement video. Let's say this is our announcement video, y'all. Okay, but I'm gonna be eating while I'm announcing. Period. Because your girl hungry. And we got some tacos. And y'all, I live in Oklahoma. So it's really hard to find some bomb. I was about to cuss. Some bomb Mexican food in Oklahoma. I don't know what it be. But it's, to me, it's hard to find bomb Mexican food in Oklahoma. Y'all know I'm from LA. So, yeah, Oklahoma don't be giving what, you know, I'm used to. But it's this taco truck in my town. And, oh my God, tacos bomb. Remind me of home, period. Um, and usually when I find like a bomb Mexican, like when I find bomb Mexican food in Oklahoma, it's usually coming out of a taco truck. I don't know what's wrong with the restaurants, but it's not giving authentic. <laughs> there is one restaurant here though that their tacos are good, but they don't top this truck. So anyway, I'm going to get y'all close up to, with my, for my, oh, uh, uh. I'm so tired. I'm gonna give y'all a close up of my food. Thank y'all. I'm excited because I did go to work today. Girl, look at them tacos. Yes, you know. Come on, y'all. I'm already dropping stuff. If you know, you know. You got to get. You got to get that creamy green sauce. I don't know what they call the sauce, but it's good. And just know that that green sauce be spicy as heck, y'all. You would think the red sauce spicy? No, the green sauce is spicy for it, but it's so dang good. So that's what we working with. I got my. I don't know if you know if I be saying this right. I don't know, if you, like you say jarito or it's just jaritos. I don't know, but y'all already if you know you know. If you don't know, run to Walmart because I got them at Walmart. I know because I got this one from Walmart. You need to go get you one. And then I have this one water. <laughs> So basically, uh, I'm happy because I don't know if y'all can hear like, like the noise in my background, but it's snowing outside, ice snowing. But before it was snowing, we had got like some freezing rain, and all day today the temperature is supposed to stay in the 20s. So that being said, the rain and stuff it sticks to the ground, and the ice actually the snow is gonna stick to the ground too. So let's make everything slippery outside. Let's get to the point of this video and why I'm making this video. <laughs> Cause I can talk all day. Literally talk all day about nothing. So basically, hold on, let me make sure I get my sauce and my taco. I'm not gonna hold y'all. Like I'm really stalling. <laughs> but I have been waiting a long time, y'all. I've been waiting a long time to tell y'all this. But anyway, basically, girl, 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 girl. I was, I don't know, I was so nervous to tell y'all, like, like, I'm going to get in trouble. <laughs> because I'm grown. Period. Yeah, girl, is pregnant. Yes, I'm pregnant, y'all. And I've been waiting. I'm going to get y'all close up. This is baby B, baby Benson. Can y'all see that? That my baby head. He got a big head. I don't even know if it's a heat, honestly. I did get like this test done. And my baby little legs. Last my last appointment was on the 26th of Jan January 26th, actually. And when I said baby was moving, like I mean my baby was moving like a track star. Okay. That baby was moving like a track star. Okay. So I don't know what it is. But I keep saying he. I want a girl, y'all. <laughs> I mean, of course, I want anything that's healthy. Period, girl, boy. But, like, let's not knock that. 
we still be wanting what we want. I'm not saying we're not going to love whatever we get. But I want it to be a girl. I do. I want a little vision. I feel like, but I also feel like the world ain't ready for a little vision. But how cute would that be? But I keep saying he and everybody, everybody wanted to be a boy, especially on my husband's side. Everybody wanted to be a boy. <laughs> I wanted to be a girl. I want a daughter. I mean, I I want three kids. Like originally, I want three kids. I want two boys and a girl. Like mom has mama had two boys, and then me, I was the girl. And I'm the baby. So originally, I want two boys and a girl. But I don't know, like, um, I want to have my boys first. <laughs> but I mean, I'm gonna get whatever God give me. But I, I want a girl. Like I want this one to be a girl. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> That's so. Like, in my heart, I know it's going to be a boy. <laughs> I just feel like it's going to be a boy, y'all. You know, anybody into this taco, because I'm playing with myself. I mm -hmm. Y'all, I know it's going to be a boy. I, I feel like it's going to be a boy. But we still got hope. When I say it's been a struggle, <laughs> it's been a true freaking journey. Like, man, like, <laughs> it's like me and my husband were trying for a child. But. I just feel like, dang, nobody said all oh, this was going to happen. Sorry, I'm trying to get some more of this sauce out. Even though I got like two more things of sauce on the side of me over here. But, um, and like I said, y'all got to be careful with that green sauce. That green sauce hot. That's another thing, y'all. Like, I've been eating a lot of spicy foods. I don't know. Before my pregnancy, I love spicy food. Before my pregnancy. Um, and I can going off to college, and as I got a little older, I kind of slowed down on eating a lot of spicy food. When I got about pregnant, spicy food has been where it's at. Now, I try not to eat <clears throat> like overly spicy stuff just because I don't want, like, you know, the risk my pregnancy and stuff but oh my gosh like nowadays with my tacos and the tacos i get from like the truck i go to because they had a sauce <clears throat> i put this sauce on it right you know spicy whatever um anything else i cook in my house or like something i warm up or something um i put tapatio on it so like everything tapatio okay i got a bag of chips Tapatio. Some chicken, tapatio. Everything. Maybe hidden. So let's talk about this pregnancy. So I am currently now in my second trimester. Um that's why I've been like waiting to tell y'all. It's because I was waiting to get into my um I feel like a savage, like just on my fingers i've been waiting i wanted to wait to get into my second trimester before i announce it to you guys even before i announce it to like the rest of my family like a few of my family already knew but i also waited to my second trimester to like all of my family members yeah that was a hot mess one thing about it two things for sure your girl was tired that was part of the reason why, part, because that's not the whole reason, but part of the reason why I wasn't posting videos like that is because I was tired, like, <clears throat> big tired, okay? Smacking. Anyway, I was big tired, y'all, like, I mean, I get off of work. I go straight to my bed. 
Like, and there'll be times where I'll try to like clean up something in my house, but like I can only I, I can only do so much. Like, if I did the dishes, oh baby, I'm not cooking. <laughs> my back hurt now. <laughs> I, I'm 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 tired now. Like I'm exhausted just for like doing the dishes, and it don't have to be a lot of dishes in the sink. Like if I'm just, like if I'm just standing up for a good minute or whatever, and I get tired. I got tired really quickly. Um, going to work wasn't that bad. Like me going to work during my first trimester wasn't bad. Symptoms I was just really really tired. Um, I was nauseous. Um. But it wasn't like a bad, like, I didn't feel like sick, sick. Like, it was just, I was, dang, it's a ladybug in here. <laughs> I was just like, um, like, I'll be nauseous when I haven't eaten in a minute. So, like, every two hours, I was had to eat something. I understand every two hours I can't eat a meal, right? Because that, that don't make sense. Um, but, like, I will have to snack on something in between my meals that I would eat. So, like, if I don't eat anything for a long time, I get, like, nauseous. Um, I never got nauseous eating, but I don't eat as much. But right now, these tacos, I'm about to mess up. I don't care. But usually, like, I, I couldn't eat that much. Like, I was wasting a lot of food. Like, especially when we went out or something, I'd be barely touching my plate, and I'd be done. Like, I'm already full I probably should have wrote this down like my mama said, but you know I'll be listening. Um, I didn't have any food aversions. Like my first, <clears throat> my first trimester, when it came to food, baby, listen. Um, I, I lied. I had one food aversion in my first trimester. My one food aversion was um eggs crazy because me i'm not a big egg person but like if it's breakfast time i'll be out somewhere I, i'll get like if it's a breakfast theme place i'll get some eggs with my meal that's not a big deal like i'm not gonna wake up in the morning like oh i just want some eggs i'm not that type of person but if there's eggs in front of me i'll eat them mm -mm. and i tried them in all different styles <laughs> i was like maybe it's just the eggs being cooked this way I can't do no scrambled bull, whatever. I just, I can't, I can't do the eggs. Um, I haven't thrown up in my, here's how, I'm lying to y'all. I did the last, my last week of my first trimester, I threw up. But, it wasn't like a, I, it wasn't regular. I almost, first off, the first time I threw up in my pregnancy, I almost died. Uh, so I got me some McAllister. I got like this turkey sub, turkey veggie sub or whatever. And if you know McAllister's, you know they lemonade. Bomb. They got the um, natural squeeze lemonade type. So, y'all, I love me some good lemonade. Especially if it's natural squeeze lemonade. Anyway, so I got some lemonade from there too. And so I was like, I was sleeping. <laughs> and in my dream, I feel like this going to get on my sweater. Oh, what is that? Oh, from the chili. Okay, so in my dream, I was drinking on lemonade. <laughs> this is so stupid, but this is really happy, y'all. So in my dream, I was drinking on lemonade. <laughs> and I woke, I woke up out of nowhere. And when I woke up, I realized I was, like, choking. So I'm, like, I'm coughing up, like, spitting up, um, you know, trying to open up my airways and stuff. So I spit up a little bit on my bed. So I have to clean that up and everything. But anyway, I like run to the restroom. I'm still choking, bro. Still choking. So I run to the restroom. And I'm over the sink, coughing, 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 trying to clear out my airways and stuff. It was ridiculous. Anyway, basically in my dream, I, I threw up in my dream. And it came, <laughs> it came up through my throat, but it also came out my nose too. So it was ridiculous. So I couldn't breathe out my nose or out my mouth. So I'm like coughing, trying to blow my nose, coughing. And it was ridiculous. So all I feel like all the coughing and stuff, it made me like gag. And then I felt it coming up. I was like, yeah, I'm about to throw up. So I had like run to the toilet and I threw up. But that was like the first time I ever threw up. <laughs> That's another one. 
burping. I don't know if y'all know this, but my grandma told me she know this. That, um, <laughs> y'all see me burping in my videos. <laughs> That's why. Like, I mean, mad burping all the time, y'all. Um, oh my gosh, gassy, gassy all the time. I don't mean no freaking sense. Um, yeah, but the burping is out of control. Like, I feel like I'm burping every like three minutes. I'm burping. Um, what's in the oh? I guess I lied when I said my only food aversion was eggs. Because honestly, uh, with this pregnancy, I can't eat anything sweet. Like, I can't eat sweet stuff, but like, I don't want nothing sweet. Like, if it's sweet, I really won't go towards it. Like, if you put some Lay's in front of me, or let's see what's one of my favorite sweet snacks. So I will say cupcake, but I don't really eat cupcakes like that. Or ice cream. Y'all know I love ice cream. Lay's or ice cream for a snack. If I wasn't pregnant, I always would choose ice cream. I never say no to ice cream. But, like, I would choose the Lay's because, like, I, I can't do the sweet stuff, y'all. It's just... Like, I got these cookies that I bought. Um, that's crazy because I don't know if I bought these cookies when I, when I knew I was pregnant. Or before. Okay, so the vanilla bars, I knew I bought those. I knew I was pregnant when I bought those. I still got two packs of those because, like, I can't eat them. They're so sweet. Like, sometimes I eat them. Well, really, I ate them, like, when we were on a road trip because I know I'm having something to snack on. But just laying around my house, I'm not touching those. Because they're sweet. Like, I can't do food. Like, not sour, but, like, sour candy. I mess up. But it had to be, like, really sour. And y'all know sometimes candies be out here be like, yeah, sour. But it's just sweet. Uh-uh. It really have to be sour, for real. I'll, I'll eat some sour candy. But, like. Cupcake, cookies, ice cream. I'm sad about the ice cream. Ice cream and stuff like that. I will not eat. Which is crazy. God been turning on ice cream trips. This pregnancy is ridiculous. Um. Let's see. Cravings. Do I have any cravings? I don't think so. That's a lie. Well, I don't know because honestly, I've been eating what I've been eating minus the sweet stuff and eggs. But like, I feel like I've been eating what I've been eating just a little bit more because I'm pregnant. I don't know. But like, I have been putting tapati on everything. But I don't think that's a, well, I guess I'm craving spicy stuff because I'm putting tapati on everything. I'm, I'm wanting stuff to be spicy. So, maybe that, like, um, the little tapatio thing, I'm putting on everything. Like, I like the tapatio before, but I I, didn't, I, ain't, I wasn't the one that put tapatio on everything. Like, oh, I have to have it, I have to have it. Girl, nah, I have to have it now. <laughs> um, oh, okay, 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 okay. So, this was a craving. Uh, blue Doritos and tapatio. Shut the front door. Because, listen... Blue Doritos and Tapatio hit, okay? I don't know, I was, just, I was just sitting there one day and I was like, I saw a commercial. I think I saw a commercial about Blue Doritos. But I was like, oh, Blue Doritos sound good right now. So I know Blue Doritos good. I was like, that sound good right now. I haven't had no Blue Doritos in a minute either. So I was like, that sound good. And I thought about it. I said, oh, that sounds even better with some Tapatio. So I went out, I got the Blue Doritos. I think I already had my Tapatio. But I went out and found me some blue Doritos. I hooked that mess up. Oh, yeah. Blue Doritos and Tapatio definitely was a smash. So, that's a must every time. <laughs> I did find, like, say we went to Dollar General to get some snacks and stuff. Because we about to be snowed in, y'all. Or iced in. But, uh, I found the Cool Ranch uh, Flaming Hot Doritos. So, I know that's going to hit. Because it's Cool Ranch, but it got some spiciness to it. So, yeah. Anyway. So, that was one. Uh, the, cool, the Cool Ranch with the Tapatio. Um, 
what? I don't think I have any other cravings. And like the beginning, beginning of my pregnancy, I want, oh, okay. <laughs> so when I found out I was pregnant, right? Uh, no, this was before, was it? Uh, y'all, yeah, I don't know. Hold on. I don't know if this was before I found out in the first trimester, regardless. Uh, for like two days straight. This was like early on in my pregnancy. I, I could say that it was early on in my pregnancy. For two days straight, y'all. When I say I wanted straight bacon, like it was bacon, everything. I wanted bacon, like. <laughs> and me, like, I'm not crazy about bacon. Like, I'm not like, we'll have some bacon in my fridge and it probably don't get touched for like the weekends. And stuff like that so we have like time to cook it or somebody want to cook breakfast it's bacon in there but uh no like <laughs> like i want it bacon like i woke up and i'm like i just want some bacon like i just want bacon like nothing else just bacon so i i woke up and i cooked me some bacon and it was so good but this is how i knew i, I said I'm, I'm so i'm real mad i don't know if this was before i found out i was pregnant or i already knew i was pregnant but regardless, this is how I knew I'm pregnant because I just wanted bacon. Like, and I think that day my school was doing like a, uh, that day my school was having a, um, who was having? My school was having, um, y'all forgot what I was saying. Anyway, my school was having like this breakfast thing. That's what it was. My school was having this breakfast thing going off. And um I really just forgot that. <laughs> That's right. Okay. I'm back. So my school was having this breakfast thing going off. And mind you, this day I woke up. Wanted to buy bacon, right? I already cooked me some bacon for breakfast in the morning. And, uh, so they were having this breakfast thing going on. It was really for, like, oh, if you want, if you want to grab your plate or something, you can come on and do that, whatever, to have leftovers. So I was like, bet. This whole time walking to this, the, the room that I was in, I was praying they had bacon, y'all. I was praying they had bacon. But they didn't. So I was so sad. Like I was I was mad sad <laughs> that they didn't have bacon. That's all I wanted. I just wanted bacon. But I went home for lunch and cooked me some bacon. Like it was like four pieces of bacon. It satisfied the mess out of me. But that's how I knew, like, yeah, I'm I'm big pregnant because what the heck? I ain't never happened. But that, that happened for like two days. I just wanted bacon, nothing but bacon. Two days. Um Pickles was another one. I love me some pickles. I love pickles before. But I ain't never loved pickles like like I love pickles now. Okay, so pickles. Um, I eat what I bear was eating. Maybe just a little bit more. But no weird cravings. Um, we'll see. I'll give y'all another update. <laughs> we'll see. Um, what else, y'all? Oh, my back hurt. Period. My back hurt. Back been hurting since day one. Um, and now I'm at the point where like my hips, waist area, or not really my waist, but like my waist down, so like my hips, my butt, and like my joints, like my hip joints, and like my I guess my pelvic area. <coughs> It's been really sore lately, like all the time. Lately, it's been really sore. But like I talked to my doctor, he just said that's like, you know, my uterus growing, so it's expand. It's it, my uterus expanding, so it's it's pushing everything else out the way to expand. So that's the situation for that. And I think this baby gonna be big. Um. But I think that baby gonna be big. What else? This 
Put it all over the place. But anyway, keep up with me. At the beginning, okay, let's talk about <clears throat> let's talk about how I knew I was pregnant. Okay? Because I knew I was pregnant, y'all. Of course, me and my husband was trying. So I think I also know a little bit easier too because I was already aware that we was trying for one. So uh I was looking out for more stuff that was like out of the norm for me. And there were a couple things a lot of the norm. One, vivid dreams. That's true. People are not lying when they say the vivid dreams. And they they weird now. My vivid dreams were weird. Like it's they're embarrassing. They're embarrassing to talk about weird. So vivid dreams. Yes, Vivid Dreams is one of them. That, that was weird. They're weird. Damn, this video, I'm going to cut a lot of this out. Anyway, Vivid Dreams. How was I knew I was pregnant? Um, I did have, like, cramps in one place of, like, my uterus. And it was, like, just in that place. I feel like that was another um, telltale. Um... What oh um extremely tired. I was tired. I was tired. Like since day one, I was tired, y'all. I mean like I ain't never I ain't never been that tired. Like the amount the tiredness I had in my first trimester. I ain't never, never been that tired before, y'all. It's a different type of tired. Like it put me out. <laughs> um See, y'all, I should have wrote this down because, girl, you know you forget everything. Um, yeah. I did have a little bit of pregnancy brain in the beginning. Like, I'd be stuck, like, crazy. Um, so, vivid dreams, tiredness. I, I, I got pregnancy brain early on. Um, what, oh, how else did I know? I feel like I'm missing something. I was mad at at everything i was i don't say i was mad at everything i was irritated about everything like everything irritated me like i felt so bad because like uh like throughout my first trimester i'll be like apologizing to my like it was early early because early. once i found out i was i was pregnant i still was getting irritated at everything but um, I kind of had a little, I had, I handled it a little better, but when I didn't know I was pregnant yet, yeah, my emotions was everywhere. I was apologizing to him, so I was like, I was like, I think I'm pregnant because I, I'm sorry, like, I'm, I'm sorry I'm being a B, the B word. I ain't trying to cuss like that in my videos, but, um, yeah, yeah, I, I, I might just end the video here because... Uh, like I said, I just got into my second trimester. I am currently 14 weeks pregnant. So, um, I might do a, a pregnancy update for my second trimester when I get into my third trimester. That way I can go through it. And I, and I will write stuff down for y'all. I'll write stuff down. So, that way I don't have to, like, parts and parts when something come up. I have to come back on camera and do something again. No, I'm going to just wait till the end of my second trimester. And I do a second trimester video update. But, yeah, that's everything I've been going through so far. So far, so good. I'm just like, I, I be tired. I feel like right now, I'm kind of getting a little bit more energy back. I feel like, maybe it's in my head, but I feel like I'm kind of getting a little bit more energy back. Um, Like, when was it? Two days ago? Uh, like I was supposed to do a part three, clean up my bedroom. Two days ago, I think I got mad. And... I just clean my house. I got deep clean my kitchen. Right now, I got a couple of dishes to do because I did cook some breakfast this morning. But I, I deep clean my kitchen. I mopped the floors. Um, um, I ended up cleaning out my bedroom. I have right now. I just have a whole bunch of laundry to do. Like, uh, but me being iced in right now. When I get off the video with y'all, I'm about to go start on that. 
and then hopefully i'll have to go to work tomorrow because i can continue working on laundry and i can try to get that done before this week is up and um yeah i don't really touch my living room in my videos much because we do have a friend living with us um he actually just bought a house so he's been living with us for a couple weeks because um he was trying to get his house and stuff which congratulations to him he just closed on his house um, but he's still, we're waiting on a couple things to get fixed. Uh, I know he had an electric problem with the house, so we have to wait till that get fixed. And then I think right now they did fix, they did fix his electric problem, but they're changing out his outlets and then, um, his inside of his whole house had to get painted. So he's still with us for a couple more weeks. Hopefully out before Valentine's Day. Um, love him to death. But uh, I'm the type of person. This this might be a lot of information, y'all. But I'm that type of person. I don't like the word clothes in my house. <laughs> so I've been having to do that. Uh, love him to death, though. But yeah, we're super excited that he got a house. Like, he really closed on a house. Like, he really got here being a grown man. Anyway, <laughs> hopefully that's us two years. Uh, yeah, y'all. So I haven't been filming my living room because it has this stuff in it. And uh, but yeah, I think this is gonna be the end of this video, y'all. Um, uh, I'm talking about like I'm gonna fold these clothes. I might end this video and go take a nap. I'm not gonna lie to you, and then fold some clothes. But <laughs> I'm so happy I finally told y'all I'm pregnant, y'all, because I y'all know how bad I really wanted to tell y'all. I really wanted to like put it out there um but yes thank you so much for tuning in with your girl uh please make sure you like comment subscribe uh comment some video ideas you might want to see on my channel um yeah until next time